Crusade Storm Team Forecast with Chief Meteorologist Joe Calhoun. I often say the farther you can see, the better it'll feel this time of the year. No haze out there, just blue skies, few, few clouds. Just a gorgeous looking afternoon. For most of us, it's going to be a, a beautiful looking day. Right now, York, it's 73 degrees. Sunshine 70s. Man, that is nice this time of the year. More importantly, look at the dew point at 58. Dew points in the 50s, it feels fine. The air is dried out and it's very nice, nice northwesterly breeze. Gonna feel pretty good through the afternoon. None but sunshine, just a few wispy clouds. Pleasant afternoon. We'll get above 80 degrees, I think, in many locations, but again, the humidity's down, so it feels Feels real good out there. And it's going to feel pretty good this evening, too. Mostly clear, comfortable. Uh, overnight tonight, we'll drop it down into the 60s for overnight lows. So, comfortably cool, we should say. No doubt there's going to be some 50s in some of the countryside. And then tomorrow, we'll start with a little sun. I think by this time tomorrow, though, it's getting cloudier. And I think it clouds over in the afternoon. Showers, maybe a thunder shower. Nothing severe, I don't think. Uh, but we could get some, uh, some pretty good rain coming in later tomorrow, tomorrow night. Maybe another half inch of rain. Yeah, on top of all, it's been a pretty wet June. 80 to 84 degrees for tomorrow. Not real humid, though. It gets a little stickier late in the day. You hear the stats yesterday. All the way up to 89. I will just mention, I don't think we get to near 90 for at least the next week, maybe 10 days. Half inch of rain officially, although there are parts of Cumberland County at three inches of rain in a matter of an hour. Most reporting stations, about a half to three quarters uh, in York and Lancaster, a little less in Lebanon. Chambersburg came in just about a half inch of rainfall. Temperatures right now mostly 70s all across the board, mid to low 70s even. And yeah, those dew points we show you often this time of year. Yesterday they were up near 70. Look at them now in the, in the 50s. That, that just feels real nice out there. So with that dry air, there's no precipitation around the region. There's the storms from yesterday well out to sea. They're halfway across the Atlantic now. Clear skies. There's another disturbance out in the Midwest. That's going to head in our direction. But high pressure gives us a northerly flow, comfortable day today, and a clear, cool, calm night tonight. That moves out of the way. This disturbance moves pretty quickly in. Some showers, maybe a thunder shower, rumble or two late in the day or tomorrow evening. Then that starts moving out. Get a break. And Friday's not looking like too bad a day, although a rainmaker for the weekend could bring in some more clouds late on Friday. Looks like we will see temperatures, though, pretty comfortable. 60s tonight. And look at this for tomorrow. Low 80s. Yeah, still none of that heat coming back. And I don't see it. In fact, we uh, may get to near 80 on Friday and then maybe not the 80s through the weekend or into the beginning of next week. I could even see Saturday, depending on the timing of the rain, being in the 60s. I was going to say, might not hit long. 70 on Saturday. That's a big change. That is. Wow. I, I, the, the pattern has really shifted now, now that we're going into July. It makes complete yeah, well, sense of course. to me. Yeah, well, it should get cooler as we go into July. I'll tell you what, the next two days, though, really nice summer days. Not bad. Yeah. All right. Thanks, Joe.